Today we are signaling to some of our most at-risk communities that we haven't forgotten about them. While cases of COVID, of the COVID-19 pandemic are dwindling, the financial impact on the pandemic put on our families continues. It's the working families in all corners of our state who need and um, who need are facing these struggles. Um, I am proposing in this uh, this this package a an increase to the earned income tax credit from 18 to 19 percent of the federal EIC. Um, we know that the the earned income tax credit is one of the most effective anti -pover poverty. Excuse me. Let me say that one more time. We know that the earned income tax credit is one of the most effective anti-poverty policies uh, in the nation, and the earned income tax credit helps lifts our state's low to moderate income families out of poverty uh, through promoting work and expanding economic security. I want to make a key point in that we have families out there making decisions if they go to work or if it's more affordable to stay home and take care of their children because of the the high cost especially to child care and this is an initiative to make sure that those folks can actually go to work and that's what we want people to do is to be able to go to work um, you know and, and and provide for their families and so uh, the increase to this uh, is certainly needed throughout our state but it has an even greater impact on 3.6 million uh, Illinoisans who receive it when it comes to increasing children's ed educational performance and attainment and improving health outcomes. These families rely on us for, uh, they rely on us for help. We must show them we see and acknowledge the need uh, for more.